in the split test campaign and I've just launched my first ad set and the first split test I'm going to be doing is interests because I want to figure out my targeting first of all. Um, now this website is one I've run for quite a while now, a couple of months and so I already have a good idea of the age and gender of the people and the interests but just for the sake of this course I'm showing you how I would do it theoretically if I needed to do it again to split test to find out the working interests. So so this ad set is called Interests 1, General Activity plus General Music slash TV. What Interests 1 means is this is my first interests split test and every, every other interest that I sp I'm split testing um, against these will also come under Interests 1. And then after that, I will simply type the the variant. So in this case, general activity and general music slash TV. So I'm going to now duplicate this ad set and I'm going to call the next one interests one because it's part of this split test. And what I will call it is general activity plus celebrities. And what that means is I've stacked general activities interests with celebrities in this niche in this next ad set. In this ad set I've stacked general activities plus general music slash TV channels and genres that I believe this audience are going to be interested in. Okay so I'm going to do that right now. Okay so I've now got three different ad sets running. All of these three ad, three ad sets are completely the same, exactly the same other than the fact that they have different interest targeting. So in this one, we have magazines, blogs, and websites, not stacked. We don't have a plus, which means it's not stacked. It's just one block of interests. In this one, we have celebrities in the music space, so singers and bands, etc., stacked with fashion interests. Then in this one, we have a general activity stacked with general music channels and genres and TV shows and channels. They're all running at five pound a day budgets and we are now split testing these interests and we're going to see which audience, which set of interests generates a better response. These are website conversion ads optimized for add to carts by the way and we're going to judge this on the CPM, CPC and the number of add to carts and the cost per add to cart.